A day for the ages as we look at the Vatican tonight, where it's after midnight. Two popes were canonized there together for the first time. A crowd of 800,000 filled St. Peter's Square to witness church history. Popes John Paul II and John XXIII were elevated to sainthood by two living popes, Francis and Benedict. Our Paula Evan is live at the Vatican tonight. Paula, good evening to you. Dozens of nations represented, 24 heads of state in attendance, and the head of the Roman Catholic Church presiding over a first in church history. Pope Francis and Pope Benedict became the first two living popes to canonize two past popes in an ancient tradition in St. Peter's Square. Cardinal Sean O'Malley took part in celebrating the Mass among 150 cardinals, which also included former Boston Cardinal Bernard Law. The official proclamation came quickly from the Pope. We declare and define Blessed John the 23rd and John Paul II to be saints to the applause of the faithful. For me as a child, I always thought of saints as people on holy cards. To Kate Fullen of North Andover, it was the culmination of a journey that began long ago on a rainy October day in Boston. To know that this is John Paul II, someone that I have just loved since a little girl, when, to, when he came to Boston and said Mass in the Boston, Carmen, Boston Common, it was so special for me to be here. So glad I came. For student Peter DeFazio, a seminarian at Pope John XXIII Seminary in Weston, the day was just as much about the future as it was the past. I love Pope Francis. I think he is absolutely a breath of fresh air. And I think that, that he is doing something similar to Pope, now Saint, John the 23rd, in terms of his engagement. This is spectacular. This has been, this is a once in a lifetime trip. Pope Francis circled St. Peter's Square to cheers to end the epic day as pilgrims streamed into the basilica to begin praying to their newest saints. So the popes will now be referred to as Pope St. John the 23rd, Pope St. John Paul the Second. And coming up at 11, one of the most interesting, surprising moments of the day came in something that Pope Francis said in his homily to his bishops. I'll have that coming up at 11. Live at the Vatican, Paula Evan, WBZ News. Bobby, back to you.